friends, it's me, Luca Angel, and I hope you're enjoying this year's self-denial series. I love telling you about the ways the Salvation Army is helping people around the world. There are so many interesting projects, core and centres helping their communities share the love of Jesus and help those in need. Here in Australia, we are so lucky to have many things that other countries don't have easy access to, like clean water from our houses, good medical care. In some countries, they need to walk many kilometres to collect water, and they don't even have water at school. In other places, people need to walk to the hospital as they can't afford cars or ambulances. The Salvation Army has many projects around the world to help people live healthier and happier lives, like this one in South Africa. Self-denial funds were used here to build a new toilet blocks and provide clean water for 11 communities. This will help improve education, health and livelihood of thousands of people in the region. Also in Africa, the Salvation Army has a community care project in the country of Eswatini. People from the Salvation Army visit people who are sick and check that they are taking their medication. They show love and care for many people too sick to walk to the clinics by themselves. The third project I'll show you today is in Moldova, a country in Eastern Europe. Many people don't have access to good medical care in the countryside, so the Salvation Army started a mobile health clinic to go to them. When Jesus was on earth, he showed great love for people who needed his help. By giving to the self-denial appeal, we can give to other people around the world who need our help. What is something you could give up and give the money to the self-denial appeal? I would give up the money I normally spend at the shops, like when I buy toys and sweets. So I would save that money and donate it to the self-denial fund. The screen money? I'll go without my junk food money. You're all so encouraging. Through God's mighty power, He can use us to do more than we can even imagine. See you next week. <laughs>